you know, we were looking to build on the momentum we achieved um, in the performance against Canada, so there hasn't been wholesale changes. Um, you know, we think guys generally put their hand up and deserve a second opportunity, and you know, the nature of this tour is that we've only got two games, so um, there isn't really the luxury to chop and change too much. Um, and we don't want to, you know, it's a young squad and um, we feel if we can have some you know, continuity of selection that we hopefully get continuity of performance um, and that will set us up well for, you know, future tours. A couple of guys that um, missed out on the game against Canada get their opportunity, so Kepa Mewitt comes into the second row. Uh, I know a lot about Kepa, he's obviously from, from Bay of Plenty and uh, he was a captain, had a, had a really sound season, did, you know, fronted up really well against the um, British and Irish Lions um, for the Barbarians, so I'm really confident in his ability to, to de deliver in the areas that we want him to. Um, and then also uh, Jonathan Dudu and Tay Walden, both out of Otago, who, you know, they've both been playing really well now for, for a good part of two seasons, so they, they get their opportunity. You know, Jono's a bigger boy, and against the French, we might need somebody that's um, you know, a virtual you know, half a forward. Um, and Tay, um, you know, he gives us a bit of versatility on the bench, so really happy, happy for them that they're going to get their chance. Yeah, I would certainly no slide on um, on Ihai. We thought he did particularly well too. He certainly kicked um, kicked really well for territory and that, and that goal. Um, Jackson's just you know he's had a he's had an outstanding minor ten cup and um, a little bit like the you know the the halfback situation. Jackson gives us a little bit more size and has the ability to be direct if we need to go that way and. Um, Mihai will give us some um, some speed off the bench, so that's why we've gone down that track. We expect them to be, you know, want to take us on up front, um, more for penalties, scrum for penalties, you know, be be direct. But it would be remiss of us to think that they aren't going to, you know, play traditional barbarians rugby at some stage in the game and look to give it some air, which is, you know, French rugby, let alone barbarians rugby. So a little confusing. So we'll prepare for all challenges.